Hey YouTube, another LG5K ultrafine motherboard. I actually had two, the one other one I fixed actually. But anyway, so uh, in this video I wanna talk about another issue I faced with these boards. If the you, uh, Thunderbolt port is mangled completely and uh, some pins are crisscrossed, there is a high chance of the Thunderbolt controller going out. Uh, this have been the case in my two last motherboard, last two motherboards. Some of these bar motherboards, you know, are newer, some are older, but the uh, Thunderbolt controllers, I actually had two in stock. One, I was trying to fix another board, which was not the issue, but uh, another one, the tool to extract data from the 2016-17 MacBook Pros. But anyway, I was replacing that Thunderbolt controller too on that little board. Um, so the, the two Thunderbolt controllers I've seen on these boards is JHL7440 is this one. And this one is JHL6540. So this one's 6540. So if you 100% sure that you replace the port, the port looks good, everything soldered properly, and you still test on the tester, this tester is actually really convenient in figuring this out. But I'm gonna show you what you need to look for to know if this is, you know, to have, I mean, you, you never know, but to have an idea if this is actually the Thunderbolt controller. So, if you're gonna see like zeros in this area or this area, so this has to be kind of across each other. Anywhere you put it, uh, there should be measurements right here. So we didn't have these measurements in this case, but this is not still not correct. There's a zero L, which should should not be, but I think I found another issue on this board. But this is what you need to look for. Check it out. This connect, you know, these two uh, measurements, these two and these two. And those measurements, you can also check it out on the board, not on this particular one. You cannot really check this, but actually you can. Let me switch to the microscope view. These are, the, these are these measurements I'm gonna show you on these diodes, basically. So this is a red probe to ground, and you can actually check. So this is one of these, the second one. So this is, this is zeros, and this one, and this ones. So, and those lines go into this Thunderbolt controller, as you can see. Okay, so this is replaced. As I mentioned, I have another issue. I think I found this issue on the other side of the board. I was looking at it, it should not be 0L, open line, I meant. Anyway, so this is the, I was looking at this, at this uh, uh, coil, L101, and if you can measure this, two pins are good, and these pins are not good, which is open line, which I think is my last problem until this particular board is fixed. So on this particular board, it's tested, it's good now, but on this particular board, I ended up replacing not just JHL, which one is it? 6540. Not just that 6540. I also ended up replacing the coil, as I mentioned. I just saw it blown here. I ended up replacing that coil. And I also ended up replacing another Thunderbolt controller, which with the. Let me switch it to the microscope, which was originally. Uh, Right here, TPS 65983. 
and I replaced it with this TPS nine uh, TPS six five nine eight three BA from a newer board BA as you can see and the reason I replaced it as well because I traced I traced the pin the pin number eight or seventeen whichever way you test it seventeen so one of these I'm not I don't remember which one which pin was it so instead of open line one of these was showing 0 0.07 so it was kind of 0 0.07 ohm to ground so it was basically shorted now one of the lines was shorted let me show you under microscope so it ended up being um, on the other side of the board I was actually the way I was tracing it is it was this line basically this line right here this dot okay I traced it all the way to the other side of the board right here so this was this this line okay right here and then all the way so I was tracing it through the VS across the board it was another there was another here right here that's this line and it went all the way to this chip right here okay so this is how I traced that line it's supposed to be open line it was not it was shorted to ground so I ended up replacing this this controller and now the board is in uh, full working order the other one I was able to fix just by replacing the Thunderbolt controller but um, Anyway, so this is the video about other issues I found on these boards because I've been fixing them. I love these monitors and I'm fixing these boards a lot. If you need your 5K ultra fine motherboard fixed, either you have broken Thunderbolt connector or it's just not working, hit me up at info at applepytech.com and I'll take care of it. So thank you very much for watching. If you like my videos, please subscribe and have a lovely day. Hit that thumbs up button to help me grow my channel. Bye.